Hi, my name is Brendan Chang. I'm from Laytonsville, Maryland. I am currently senior. I am majoring in electrical engineering and computer science and minoring in, in economics. So there's not that many colleges that offer both a competitive men's volleyball program and great academics. You can probably think of them off the top of your head. There's Stanford, Harvard, and MIT, and NYU, to name a few. And um, yeah, when I visited over CPW, I just felt like the culture here was so great for learning and pushing myself academically, and the volleyball team was also really competitive. So it was a great fit for me. Uh, I had the opportunity to um, be a starter when I joined the team as a freshman. So um, I had a lot of exciting opportunities early on, and one of the ones that sticks out the most to me was I think the second match we played freshman year against Baruch um, at Daniel Webster in New Hampshire. Um, it was a really long match. It went to five. I think we lost it. Actually, I know, I know we lost it. Um, I think something like 24-22 in the fifth set. So a lot of extra points to be played, and. Um, uh, yeah, I just remember being down in the fifth set, down match point, and thinking that there was, you know, the, the opportunity here is to just, you know, I get to showcase my skills and show everyone why I belong on the court. Um, and that was uh, the match that I had the most digs in in my career so far, so hopefully I get to break it this year, but as of now, at least, that's my record. So last summer, I had the opportunity to work at a startup um, called Mesosphere. And they have this really interesting problem where they're working kind of underneath a bunch, um, they're working kind of underneath the layer that a lot of companies operate at. So when you think of Twitter and Snapchat, all of that are like consumer focused. So you like download that to your phone um, and you use it as a consumer. Mesosphere operates like on the layer underneath that. So they provide, they provide services to Twitter and Snapchat so that their applications can run smoothly. And one of their problems is um, basically that when you have a bunch of companies that are paying you for their service, you want to make sure that you give them equal resources. So whether that be like, um, you want to make sure that when a user sends a request in that their, the application runs quickly and smoothly or that data is backed up. Um, and all of those kinds of services. <laughs> I never thought I would join a fraternity. Um, that's something that's really cool about MIT. A bunch of the student athletes and the general population is involved in Greek life. And um, it's different here. I know a lot of MIT people will say that, and you'll hear, that other, you'll hear other people at other schools say that too, but um, it's a really cool culture and dynamic that integrates well with MIT as a whole. Um, you just get, it's an opportunity to meet a lot of people who do a lot of things differently than you do and do a lot of things that you never thought you would do or that I thought I would do. Um, so from being involved in my fraternity, I have met a lot of people who have taught me a lot of things and, uh, about academics and culture and just uh, the experience in general.